Hi everyone, this is Tyler again here at Woodland Frenchies and we have two of our little French Bulldog puppies with us today because today's topic is what should I, what do I need to know to make sure that I find a good French Bulldog puppy? What are the different questions I need to ask to take into consider, consideration when adopting a French Bulldog? We're going to go over those questions for you guys today, um, kind of starting from the beginning to the end, just running down all those good questions for you. And you can feel free if you guys do have any additional questions to comment below. Um, if there's something I did miss or miss during this video, we would love to help you out with any of those questions. So definitely watch this video, see if I answer it, then feel free to comment and be sure to give this video a thumbs up uh, and a like um, if it did help you guys for sure. So we have Nico right here, our blue fawn Frenchie, and we have Jet, our little cream Frenchie right here. You can see these little guys, they've already been adopted and the families are going to great families who are ready for a French Bulldog and are very excited. So that kind of leads me into our first, the first question you should ask even before contacting a French Bulldog breeder is, is a French Bulldog going to be a good fit for me and my family or if it's just for yourself? So what you got to take into consideration is if you're looking for a cuddly um, laid back puppy that has energy in spurts, but really you know, is pretty chill kind of the rest of the time. Is that the right fit for you? Do you want something that's going to be pretty more active? Um, or do you want something that's going to be laid back the whole time? Let's just say maybe like a Bernese Mountain Dog or an English Bulldog. Bulldog. But for you, if, if you feel that you want a little bit of spunkiness, um, human-like characteristics, um, laughter, uh, cuteness, but then also you do want that laid backness that you know say you're making supper making lunch that french bulldog can just chill relax on its own um that could be a good reason why you'd want to go with a french bulldog if you have kids um this is a good question i feel for for families i don't know why but some for some reason french bulldogs really love babies so they can get a little bit jumpy on that because they just see a, a little kid you know a newborn to a two-year-old and they just see it as a, a, a friend of someone who wants to play with. So they're gonna wanna, you know, jump and play and interact. And sometimes kids will run away thinking that the puppy is kind of, you know, attacking or, you know, you know how a kid can be. Um, but really what it's trying to do is play. So that can be a little bit of a question mark. Do you feel, you, if, are your kids old enough for a French Bulldog? Are they gonna be able to handle, you know, and understand how to work with a puppy like that? that thinks when it's running away, it's kind of, you know, it's going to be chasing the kid and different things like that. So that's a question I think for, for you guys to determine if you are um, wanting to adopt a French Bulldog, whether you, you like their personalities or whether if you have small children um, that maybe might not be used to a puppy that, you know, is that going to be a right fit for your family? Um, other things are questions about financially, you do have to be ready for a puppy. You know, if it's going to cost uh, money, to make sure to provide food, provide um, shots, um, maybe um, different say, accidents can happen, you know, different vet bills in the future, um, different things like that. You do financially have to be prepared um, to take on, you know, basically a little kid um, to, to add to the new family, uh, to the family. So financially you have to be set, would be a kind of a good question to ask yourself. And these are, again, prep questions to ask if you guys are going to be ready for a French Bulldog. Um, one other question before you actually kind of, okay, you know you're ready for a French Bulldog, it's going to be more, but another question that you're going to be asking yourself is, you know, the space, what kind of living area, environment am I going to have? Is it going to be suitable for a Frenchie? And to be honest with you guys, a Frenchie is pretty adaptable. It can, you know, live in a small apartment to having a huge home, countryside, whether it's down south, whether it's up north, different seasons. That's one really nice thing about a Frenchie is that they are very adaptable and can basically, you know, convert or, you know, be fine with any type of environment as long as it's safe and it is, um, you know, homey and, and great for the, um, the, the puppy. So those are my top four questions, kind of pre-questions maybe to ask about if you guys are ready for a Frenchie or if it should be a breed to adopt for you and your family. So now let's just say, okay, you realize this is the perfect breed for me. Now, what kind of questions do I need to ask to make sure I get the perfect puppy? One thing I feel is very important is 
to make sure you have the puppy has the right confirmation for a French Bulldog. Confirmation in a French Bulldog, I feel is super important. You can see an amazing confirmation in these two pups right here. Be sure to look for a nice flatter muzzle like this. You can see that it's the nose barely sticks out maybe about a half an inch to an inch from the forehead in both of these puppies. And then also you wanna see that it has a nice round head, ears up, um, and then also the big thing is a nice stocky body. You don't want a long-legged French Bulldog. So when you're looking for a French Bulldog puppy, confirmation, the most standard characteristics are the head, muzzle, short stocky legs. Um, other than that, you know, there is a lot more detailed information, but that to me is kind of the most important. You want a nice short stocky uh, looking Frenchie. If you always want a smaller Frenchie, that's a question you guys can ask the breeder. Definitely ask them how big do you think they're gonna get, and that's based on the parent's weight. The normally weight of a French Bulldog is gonna be anywhere from, oh, 22 to 30 pounds average in there. So, as far as confirmation goes, that's kind of the top question to ask there. Obviously, you wanna ask about the health. Make sure that the parents are AKC registered. Um, again, that does help with confirmation and it comes from a good bloodline. So definitely ask um, or check, make sure the website provides that type of paperwork. So AKC records. Um, and you wanna, a good question asks, is this your first, the female's first litter? Has she had previous puppies? Um, have, you know, for the health, make sure that the health of the puppy is gonna be good. So the health confirmation, those are some different questions for that. Um, make sure that the breeder has a vet check around six or seven weeks. You wanna know that they'll have a paperwork for that. Just make sure that the vet has one over and you know, make sure that they are clear on things like a hernia. And that's a question to ask. So a hernia, it's an umbilical hernia. Normally it occurs right here. So make sure that that's you know, sealed. And if there is a hernia, that it, it does get fixed right away. Um, another thing would be a heart murmur to check out to make sure that uh, there's no heart murmurs with the puppy so that it's healthy. Um, then other questions then would be, you know, what kind of dog food are they eating? You wanna stick with the same puppy food that they're using. But, and then kind of what you're doing right here is another great thing to ask. Can the breeder provide videos? You wanna see the personality of that puppy. You wanna see that it's been played with, that it is, um, you know, not timid. Um, even though there's some more laid back, maybe shyer puppies, but still they shouldn't be afraid. You know, I'm walking right beside it. You know, they're not, you know, they're accustomed to people, kids, and all that good stuff. They've been really well taken care of. So personality, a video um, is always, a, you know, a must to have before you adopt a puppy, because you don't want to get scammed. You don't want to um, do, get into any predicament like that. Uh, other questions you need to find the perfect French Bulldog puppy. Um, honestly, hopefully the websites, uh, you know, provide who the family is that you're getting it from, that they're coming from a good home, good family, and that um, they provide at least a two-year health guarantee. I feel a two-year health guarantee shows that a breeder um, you know, you know, that they basically have a trust that their puppies are gonna be uh, very healthy and have any issues. Normally a genetic issue would come within the first two two years. So make sure there's a health guarantee. Right Jet. Right Jet. Huh? Get ya. Huh? 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 Yeah, you're silly. You're silly. You're silly. So any other questions you guys have, definitely comment below. I'm trying to think of a couple more unique questions. It's always good to see the parents. You know, I want to make sure that the parents are either on the website or that you can see them so that you know exactly what you're getting. Um, AKC paperwork, you should be provided that with a puppy. Uh, so if you are looking to breed a puppy, uh, this is a question you need to ask. Make sure that you get full registration. So if you're just getting a, a pet, you just need limited registration, but this is more a question for if you're looking to breed, you're, uh, one day you're gonna need full registration. So 
That's a good question to ask. Other than that, yeah, guys, I definitely want you guys to comment below with any questions you have. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel here. And I hope you've really enjoyed our content and that you can continue to watch us in the future. So definitely subscribe and we appreciate all of you guys that have been with us. Um, it shows that a lot of people are watching our videos that are not subscribed. Um, so if you haven't subscribed yet, we really would appreciate it guys. Um, Cause we do put a lot of time taking care of our Frenchies, but not only creating this content to help people, um, which is our goal. We wanna make sure that people get a amazing French Bulldog puppy, whether it's from us um, or from a, another breeder. I really, you know, don't care. I just wanna make sure you're getting a very happy, healthy French Bulldog and to know that you're gonna give it a great life, a great home um, for it to, you know, grow and be a part of your life. Cause I mean, there is just honestly, in my opinion, no better breed than a French Bulldog just because their personality looks and just a uh, really good friend. My French Bulldog sleeps with me in bed all the time and it just couldn't be without it. So thanks, hope you enjoy this video and we'll see you next time. Have a good day.